We now know the name of the 17-year-old girl who was hit and killed late last night in Bond Hill. And police say they may be one step closer to making an arrest. WLWT News 5's John London live in Bond Hill right now with the latest on this developing story. John. Yeah, Lisa, police are hoping that's the case. There is a lot of sadness that has descended on this part of Bond Hill. Neighbors around here heard the impact and heard the screams around 11 last night. A 17 year old girl from around the corner was hit as she started to cross right about here, Reading at Avonlea, knocked onto the hood of a car that did not stop. Her boots and belongings scattered along the street as Asia Denson ended up about 30 yards from the point of impact, lying in the street. Police are questioning a man they picked up around four this morning, and they are reviewing surveillance video that that uh, was uh, they took from around here. Robin Anderson came running over and began CPR to try to save the girl's life. Asia Denson was a student at Withrow, described by those who knew her as a cool person and very nice. It's the manner of her death that it was a hit and run involving a speeding car, according to neighbors, that has stunned people who lived here, left them shaken and saddened in a very deep and profound way. You know, kind of looked at me and blinked her eyes a couple of times and I knew she was in pain. I said, baby girl, you in pain. She blinked her eyes and I held her hand and I said the Lord's Prayer over. And I told her, I said, if you in this much pain, baby girl, just go ahead and go. I know your mom wouldn't want you to be in pain, so go ahead and go. And um, I just squeezed her hand and she squeezed mine. And I could feel her last breath on my face, and she just closed her eyes. And that was it. Flowers and the teddy bear mark the place where young Asia Denson was hit by a vehicle moving fast and heading north, and it kept on going. Police, as we mentioned, took a man into custody about eight hours ago. He has not been charged so far in connection with uh, this tragedy here, but they are questioning him about this terrible loss of life. Reporting live in Bond Hill, John London, WWT News 5.